Okay, here we go. And this is a 16 inch round. My color palette is Compliments of Mary Alice. And what I have is um, Azo Yellow with a little bit of Napthol Red. This is, um, I believe, Napthol Red. I think, I hope. I had it already mixed, so I'm not sure. Um, I wanted to add a pigment, so the orange shade, the deeper orange shade, is going to be TLP Horizon. And this one I just mixed up. This is Process Magenta with um, Golden's Quinacridone Magenta Fluid. And then I mixed up an olive green, and this is just sap green with carbon black and a little bit of yellow ochre to really pull that yellow tone up. I'm going to be using a white pillow, so just my PPG Multi Pro. And I'm using the last little bit of my Amsterdam Pearl Yellow Cell Activator. And it looks like I'm going to have just enough. And because this is such a large round, I'm going to be blowing it out with my little dryer. Get this centered. Looks pretty good. And just going to go for it. It's going to take a lot of pillow. And my husband's going to come home from work right in the middle of me doing this. So if he pops in the room and starts yakking, think nothing of it. I probably should have just poured straight out of my gallon can. Okay, let's see how much we have. Now, Mary Alice said she would be afraid of that palette, but fear is not something I think about. I just take it and run with it, and it is such a cool palette. Cool, warm. <laughs> okay, so not enough. I do want to make sure I have plenty to blow out. I'm putting it right in the center. Okay, so color order. Mm, I think I'm going to put the lightest orange shade down first. I want to make sure I have plenty of paint so that I get full color coverage on this giant canvas. Um... Yeah, I'm going to use the um, Process Magenta next. And you know, I'm not really, I didn't even check, I'm not really even sure which of these are opaque or um, semi-transparent or transparent. I don't think any of them are transparent except for the TLP Horizon. Now the pigment, which is going to be really weird under that olive green. Maybe not. But I have to use the olive green on the top so it'll blow to the outside. And so that I will get the cell reaction with my Amsterdam Pearl Yellow Cell Activator. You can't put that on a transparent, really. It doesn't work that well. And the olive green. Lots of it. Why not? Okay. Need to get the dryer ready. Fired up. And just pray that I have enough of the pearly yellow.
Ooh. Close. I probably should have made up just a little bit more. Oh well, whatever. I don't want to get into my pillow, but I do want to dig in to get those beautiful colors from underneath. And I should have recentered my balloon before I added the cell activator. Because I'm starting out all wonky already. Okay, I'll let it sit for a minute and then I will try to slide it. Plenty of CA. No worries there. pink all over me. That's fine. Whatever. Just going to let that set for a second. Gorgeous, gorgeous palette, Mary Alice. Absolutely gorgeous. You are my favorite person today. Let's center that up just a bit. And make sure that's broken up in the center really well. Find my tweezers. Got a little something, something in the edge. Got a few bubbles. I wasn't really paying attention. I was so excited to do this. This is definitely my reward, haha, -ha, for doing my chores. I've been up since 3.30 a.m. Um, worked from 5 to a little after 10 this morning and then came home and did my chores. All right, I'm gonna slide some gloves on and get this paint started around the edge. Okay, I chose sticky gloves. Can't get my fingers in. Not messing up my manicure, I just did it yesterday. Oh my goodness. <laughs> All right, the battle of the gloves. Oh, and I just tore it. Whatever. Okay. Let's get this moved around.
gone crazy, nothing's gone wonky. She's not moving. How's that? Thank you again, Mary Alice. Absolutely stunning palette. I'll snap a pic and I will post it for you to see.